A little more than five weeks ago, a man on a motorcycle collided with a car here, dying from his injuries. Last night, a 12 year old girl was hit, apparently trying to cross Algonquin Road right near this very same intersection. Just after 5 p.m. Monday night, Schaumburg police say a 65 year old Cicero man was driving eastbound on Algonquin Road and had the green light when 12 year old Angela Guan walked into the road against the crosswalk signal. According to police, three people in the area immediately provided aid, but she was taken to the hospital where she died from her injuries. I have daughters myself, and um, I just I couldn't imagine what the parents are, are going through right now. You know, um, something as simple as just going to 7-Eleven and go grab a snack and then you know never make it back home. It, it hits, you know, you feel it. Thomas Beltran just opened his shop, Bodega Barber Lounge, not too long ago. And already he's witnessed the scenes of two deadly collisions just steps away from his business. It's very dangerous. Yeah, it's, uh, I've been here less than six months and it's already been two casualties um, in this intersection. I, it's, it's crazy. Community Consolidated School District 15 released this statement to ABC7. Quote, our District 15 community is heartbroken by the devastating loss of one of our 7th grade Plum Grove Middle School students who was tragically struck by a vehicle in Schaumburg and heartbreakingly did not survive. Our thoughts and deepest sympathies are with the student's family, friends, classmates, teachers, staff, and all of those impacted by this tragedy. Schaumburg police say the man driving the vehicle stayed on the scene and is cooperating. They say he showed no signs of impairment, though toxicology reports are pending. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.